Jerry Mitchell, a student at Meek High School, and his sister Bray are alone at home while their parents are on vacation. The new student buddy Ravel, a purportedly aggressive and psychotic delinquent who moved from a continuation high school, is the subject of conversation among the Weaver High School students this morning. Jerry starts his day as the editor of the school newspaper, which is run by his best buddy, Vincent Costello. Jerry is given an interview by their journalism teacher, who also proposes writing an essay to welcome new kid, Buddy. After making a clumsy attempt to introduce himself after seeing Buddy in the lavatory, Jerry realizes he is bothering Buddy. He gives Buddy a friendly touch on the arm and urges him to forget about the interview request. Buddy, who is afraid of being touched, slams Jerry against a wall and says they will fight at 3 p.m. outside the school. Buddy cautions that reporting the incident or fleeing will make the situation worse. Jerry attempts several tactics as the time runs out to stay out of fights. Buddy is unreceptive to reason with. Bray tells Jerry to avoid school after Vincent hides a switchblade in Buddy's locker to have him expelled. However, Jerry discovers the ignition cables are severed and the switchblade lodged in the steering wheel of his mother's car. Duke, the overly vigilant security guard, stops Jerry when he tries to flee. After discovering the switchblade, Duke brings Jerry to Mr. Delinsky, the Dean of Discipline, who informs Jerry that he is being investigated. Jerry tries to break up the conflict with the school newspaper, but his tactics are unsuccessful until he steals money from them. In the end, Buddy takes the money to end the altercation, but he calls Jerry a coward for not even trying to fight. Furious and full of self-loathing, Jerry approaches Buddy and asks for the money back. Jerry gives in to the altercation, but Buddy declines. When the clock strikes the designated hour, hundreds of excited kids watch as the battle breaks out. Buddy punches Principal O'Rourke to the ground when he tries to break it up by touching his shoulder. Buddy pulls Franny aside and knocks out Duke as she tries to intercede, along with Jerry's companion Franny. Jerry is pushed down, yet he doesn't back down despite being outmatched. Buddy pulls out his brass knuckles, but Bray grabs it up and throws it to Jerry after Vincent diverts him. Jerry punches Buddy with desperation using the brass knuckles, winning the battle and knocking him unconscious. In the chaos that follows and the cops showing there, Buddy disappears and Jerry gets fired for the day. Students express their respect and support for Jerry the following morning. To make up for the lost money, they purchase individual sheets of paper from the school store for $1. Buddy shows in, quiets the throng, and gives Jerry his money back. Weaver is buzzing with fresh rumors as Jerry, who is purportedly dating his crush Karen, takes Buddy's position as the hottest topic. Rumors diverge greatly from reality.